YouTube, 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 you are a frustrating platform. Um, uh, <laughs> Andrew Branca's cup of coffee. Andrew, have you covered the Juan de la Cruz acquittal? OIS. Officer involved shooting of black woman who fired taser at officer in Houston. Benj Crump related the case. I have not covered it. Uh, it's probably not been televised. Uh, certainly it hasn't been on my radar screen. But if you want to send me a link, I'll be happy to take a look at it. Uh, folks, all these, we have a number of cases uh, that have been in the news and are in the news now where officers are shooting people who take control of the officer's taser. Uh, generally speaking, those are lawful uses of deadly force by the officer, despite the argument that the taser is generally less than lethal force um, in the suspect's hands. A taser being used defensively is less than lethal force, but a taser being used offensively is more than that, especially when it's being offensively used on a police officer who's obviously armed with a pistol. Because if the officer's disabled by an attacker, it's reasonable for the officer to infer that that attack will continue now that the officer's been disabled and that his service pistol will be taken from him. Many, many, many police who are shot dead in the course of their duty are shot dead with their own guns when the gun is taken from them. Every officer knows this. So uh, when the suspect sees control of an officer's uh, taser and try to use it on the officer, that is a deadly force threat to the officer. We, I covered this just a week or so ago, two weeks ago now, when I covered uh, the, uh, the probable cause hearing in the Patrick Leoya uh, shooting. Uh, you can go back and uh, look at that video. I did it a few days ago. But I haven't looked at uh, the uh, Juan De La Cruz acquittal specifically. Or Jillian Westenberg, I don't, I don't recall that name. So you have to send links, folks, with these things, uh, so I can uh, click over and, and refresh my recollection. I cover a ton of these cases, so it can be uh, difficult to uh, keep them all clearly in mind. And YouTube Studio is being 